Life Lessons with Haliriri. First life lesson, I'm going to give you tips for relaxation. Don't bring work home. Create a real weekend off. Turn off your mobile. Remember that your mind, body, and soul need to relax. Turn off the TV or the computer or whatever electrical device that you're addicted to. Take out your diary and schedule some relaxation time. Treat yourself to a massage. Consciously slow down your breathing and you'll actually feel more tranquil. Don't fill every moment of your waking day. Let there be some spaces where you can stand and stare and daydream. Also, consider why you're called a human being and not a human doing. Learn to let yourself be. Next life lesson, do what you love to do. Now you bring your own unique set of skills and strengths to the planet and until you discover and use these amazing abilities, you will feel dissatisfied and discontented. If you're struggling to become the person you most want to be, just look deep within yourself to find what really inspires and motivates you. What do you absolutely love to do? What turns you on? Are you demonstrating this passion in your life's work? If not, then why not? Next life lesson. Don't be too busy to be happy. Do you ever have time to just stand and stare and do nothing? I know there's a lot to be done, but the truth is that the world won't stop just because you have. When you get so busy that you don't have time to be happy, it's time to reassess. Why you might be afraid to stop. Maybe fear of change. Maybe the desire to be perfect. Maybe you're too anxious to delegate. Or maybe you have unrealistic self-expectations. Maybe the fear of intimacy needing to be needed, or even believing that life can't be fun. Your life is a wonderful gift. Take time to love and appreciate it. Next life lesson, let joy into your life. Joy is not the result of something happening to you, although it may seem like it. No, joy is a feeling that lies inside you. So let yourself feel it. You always have a choice in life. Are you going to take the path of joy or the path of struggle? So just for today, try the joyful path. Suspend your cynicism and negative expectations and look for joy in every encounter. And when people are unkind, thoughtless, and complaining, just recognize that they are taking the path of struggle and you are choosing to have a different experience. Remember that. I wish you my very best, live a good life, and be happy.